In construction industry, reams and reams of documents are used. The contract document, the drawings, the approvals, the quantity estimate, and the list goes on. What if the information is interactive, can be stored in a centralized system, and can be accessed easily from any part of the world? What if you can visualize the facility before construction, rectify the coordination issues, and track the progress at the work front? Since 2000, many researchers are bent on finding such a solution. Building Information Modeling BIM, is such a technology that can aid the management system. Many countries such as the US, the UK, Denmark and Sweden have tried to incorporate BIM in their construction industry. But surprisingly, the Indian AEC is still lagging in the adoption. Many efforts are underway by large construction firms to make BIM a business as usual. Several researchers have also identified critical success factors that can lead to the adoption. However, the rate of adoption is slow in Indian construction industry. Why? Change. Yes, change is pretty challenging. Especially when it comes to construction organization, this is very difficult. The personnel at the construction front tend to use the age-old practices and thumb rules and doing different is unthinkable. So, the pressing question is, how is organizational change operationalized with regards to BIM? To answer my question, I use institutional theory as a theoretical lens. Institutions are generally taken for granted and are highly persistent and resistant to change. Yet, institutions once created can change gradually over time. Change happens incrementally and through seemingly small adjustments that can accumulate to significant institutional transformation. So, undertaking a qualitative case study approach, I intend to understand the practices that bring about the change in the organization. Data collection is through open and semi-structured interviews with experts involved in the BIM adoption journey. Analysis is through open and axial coding that can lead to identified themes that can help answer my questions. The unique mechanisms that bring about the change and the change agents involved in this process is important to the study. I intend to contribute to theory development and to best practices to the industry to bring about a digital transformation. Thank you.